Greetings, Eric Backer, naturopath from New Zealand. I'm going to read some information to you from a book that I've written, and it's called Five Reasons Why You Need a Liver Cleanse. The first one, okay, first reason why you need to get your liver cleaned up is to improve your mental focus, clarity, and moods. You only have to ask someone who drinks alcohol regularly to ask what their level of mental clarity and focus is, and you'll soon work out that alcohol, a potent liver toxin, and healthy cognition do not mix. A healthy liver gives a person a powerful ability to think with clarity and to concentrate. The liver converts ammonia, a byproduct from protein digestion, into less harmful substance known as urea. An impaired or sluggish liver will not convert ammonia sufficiently into urea. And when the ammonia reaches the brain, it affects the brain's ability to function optimally. This is one good reason why you'll benefit from optimizing your liver's function, to allow it to metabolize chemicals like ammonia and other byproducts from your digestion not even taking into account the self-ingested toxins like pharmaceutical drugs, environmental poisons, and other you know, chemicals that, that could impair your liver. Those who've got a great liver function are more inclined to be in a positive and upbeat mood. People with sad livers are more prone to anger, tension, and anxiety. Just go to your local bar on a Friday or Saturday night and watch those who drink to excess. They invariably are more prone to irritability, bad moods, and anger management problems. In Chinese medicine, the liver is an organ that is connected with the emotion called anger. Anything that produces a toxic liver, according to Chinese medicine, leads to anger management problem, and to people who have problems controlling or letting go of their anger. Obviously, the more toxic and destructive the habits, like alcohol and drugs, and longer these habits are done, the worse this anger situation, of course, will be, and the flow-on effects. A clean and healthy liver will make the owner feel more relaxed and at ease and calm in their life. The other interesting thing with um, alcohol, I find, is that as you get older, your body produces less of the enzyme uh, acetaldehyde. Okay, I think it's acetaldehyde dehydrogenase is the name of the en enzyme, sorry. And then it can't break acetaldehyde down properly, a byproduct from alcohol. And when this builds up in the body, it can make you feel quite sick. Many people I speak to, sort of my age and over 50 and over, say, I can't drink as much as I used to drink. When I was 20, I could drink a whole bottle of, you know, whatever it was, and wake up in the morning and feel great. Now I have one glass and I feel like crap for two days. And that's because, you know, they're getting older. The liver ages. It produces less enzymes to break toxins down. So if you feel, you know, that this is occurring with you, I want you to really pay attention and to cut your drinking back so you can feel a lot better for it. And if you cut it out completely, you're going to feel really good. Okay, second reason why you need a liver cleanse. Improved digestion and fat burning. Now you're going to sit back and listen because we're going to talk about how you can lose weight more easily and maintain weight loss, okay? I can remember having a conversation a few years ago with Dr. Sandra Cabo, the Australian liver doctor, who wrote Liver Cleansing Diet Book. You may have that one on your shelf. And, and Sandra mentioned that if people only knew what role the liver played in weight loss, that they would certainly pay much more attention to regular liver cleansing. Did you know that your liver is your body's main fat burning mechanism? Your liver's role in the metabolism of proteins and fats makes it one of the most important of all digestive organs. Your liver produces about a pint or 600 mils of bile per day that stores in the gallbladder. Bile is one way for your body to get rid of worn out blood cells and other unwanted chemicals like redundant hormone residues. Bile helps to break down dietary fats, and it's important to correct and complete the metabolism of the fat-soluble vitamins A, D, E, and K. Correct and continuous bile flow is a critical aspect of excellent digestion, and it's one of my major goals in liver cleansing. That's why many herbs and nutrients we recommend in liver uh, cleansing are called cholagog herbs. So cholagog means that they allow the stimulation, you know, production of bile. Right? Gallstones, bloating, gas, and attacks of pain after eating fats are signs of sluggish gallbladder. So this is one of the main reasons why I like people to complete the liver and gallbladder cleansing program on a regular basis. The third reason why you need to give your liver a clean, to improve blood sugar control. Right? Your liver will control your blood sugar in multiple ways. Did you know that your liver has a large storage capacity for uh, a sugar called glycogen? Glycogen is your stored blood sugar. And when your body needs a burst of energy, the adrenal gland releases a hormone called cortisol, which liberates glycogen, which then becomes converted to blood sugar. 
which is then utilized as an energy source by the millions of cells in your body. Your liver is very clever because it can also convert other forms of sugar into glucose. The preferred fuel for your body's cells, such as conversion of fructose from fruit and galactose from dairy into glucose. The clever thing about effective liver cleanse is that it improves your body's ability to metabolize blood sugars, making this process much more efficient. This more effective balancing of blood sugars will then prevent those episodes of low blood sugar that commonly occurs with people with congested livers. So it's important for you not to get low blood sugar because that can, can make you want to go to the kitchen and grab a sandwich with peanut butter and jelly on it or to go to the fridge and get a scoop of ice cream. So when your blood sugar drops, you get a craving. A clean liver is going to help regulate the release of enough stored energy to keep you from not wanting to go to the fridge or the pantry all the time. So the fatter you get, the sicker the liver, the fatter you will become because the sicker the liver will get, if that makes any sense. The other important point worth mentioning here is that sugar cravings are more easily controlled, as I just said, reducing the likelihood of sweet cravings and weight gain that many men and women experience. I've noticed that when people get uh, over 200 pounds, they gain weight real fast. Have you noticed? And that's because their liver becomes very fatty. Right? Number four, the fourth reason why you need liver cleanse, improved immune function. Did you know that the liver has a very high concentration of white blood cells? and it's the primary immune organ in its own right. Your liver possesses a very high concentration of natural killer cells and macrophages that play an important role in preventing any infection or illness due to toxins, or xenobiotic chemicals from spreading to the rest of the body. Xenobiotic chemicals are basically chemicals of foreign origin. We don't know where they come from. Some experts state that as much as a quarter of, the, of all liver cells are white blood cells, designed to allow the liver to work very effectively as an immune filter. By regularly completing a deep cleanse, you're ensuring that your liver remains vigilant and highly efficient at, at performing its task optimally. By reducing your total toxic load and completing a detox annually, you're well on your way to preventing the many chronic, uh, you know, recurring degenerative diseases that people get, which affect people prematurely quite often. Now the fifth one, the reason why you want to keep your liver clean is to have a beautiful skin tone. Your skin is your body's largest organ and is affected very much by underlying toxins of a body that has been overloaded you know, by toxins for years. Perspiration is one of your body's ways of effectively dealing with poisons. This is why sauna therapy is important and it plays an important role in my opinion in internal cleansing. Many patients I see in their 40s or 50s complain of accelerated aging and I explain that an accumulation of free radical damage over the past 20 to 30 years you know, from things like chemicals, alcohol, drugs, nutritional deficiencies, toxins, too much sunshine, too much stress. All these things take a toll on the skin, resulting in wrinkles and loss of elasticity and collagen. A healthy and vibrant liver can help the body deal with free radicals much more efficiently. And you'll notice that those who do, don't smoke, drink or take drugs and who lead stress-free lives look many years younger than their biological age. Compared to their real age, their chronological age, did they have Botox or a facelift? No. Their aging was reduced because their liver was more able to clear out the damage before it was inflicted on their skin. Just take a look at a woman who worships the sun and who smokes. By the time she's 50, her skin can look old and wrinkly. Now look at the peaches and cream complexion of a lady who avoids the sun and who has never smoked in her life and pay her a visit on her 50th birthday and sit her next, place her next to the sun goddess. You'll be quite shocked to see the difference, incredible difference, in fact, in skin tone. To prevent accelerated aging, it is important to take antioxidants like vitamins A, C, E, zinc, and selenium. I also recommend alpha lipoic acid. And this, you can take pine bark extract, and you know, there's all other ones you can take. Regular liver cleansing will improve your body's ability to move out those free radicals. Okay. And your body can also produce collagen more efficiently which is the main substrate for, for making skin. So that way your skin can look healthy for a long, long time. And all this can be accomplished without Botox or any plastic surgery at all. Right? So clean living, healthy living, stress-free living is a fantastic way um, you know, for you to keep looking young as you get older. And look at a lot of people who do look like that, who don't take Botox, and have a look. These are, particularly if they're people uh, in the spotlight, or popular people, 
very famous people. These people, in fact, are not in the spotlight. They hold back. You don't hear a lot about them in public. But when you do see pictures of them, you'll see how fabulous they can look. There's a few movie stars that come to mind that I won't mention, but there's a few ladies I know that look absolutely phenomenal for their age, and they're not really likely to be the kind of people uh, to, you know, to, to be involved in the Hollywood scene. They're not likely to be the kind of people uh, that go for Botox or breast enhancements or things like that. And they often are very involved in meditation, relaxation, eating clean foods. Uh, even rich and famous people can be like that. right? So have a think of some of those ideas on, uh, on liver cleansing. I just hope it inspires you to keep your liver nice and clean. Because a clean liver uh, can mean an amazing life. Thanks for tuning in.